going to learn how to trace over an image and create a shape. If you notice when I click on this, it is an image and not a shape. So even though it is a silhouette, it cannot be in the shape library because it is an image. And so we need to create a shape. In order to do that, the first thing I like to do is change the opacity so it's easier to see our line that we're tracing. Next, I'm going to go into the shape library, but select the drawing tool. This only is available on the Mac. Now I'm going to pick a starting spot, zoom in a little, and go ahead and click and drag. We can create straight lines by just clicking and dragging. Or if we want to create a curve, then we can hold down and drag it so it kind of curves. So some areas you might need a curved line. I'm gonna go ahead and just trace around it. It doesn't have to be perfect because we can go back and edit. And even if you create straight lines at first, you can go back and edit those to be a little more curved if you like. So, continue. all the way around and at first it does take a lot of <laughs> practice and patience but after a while I find it be a little bit relaxing and I get a little bit addicted to it okay so now that we have completed a circle you want to make sure that you've completed that last dot to make a circle so your shape is complete we can go in to certain areas and zone in on how you want your shape to be. Um, you can even create the wings to look different than your original shape. Um, maybe some pointier wings here. There is a curve there so I can actually curve it and adjust these. So now I have my outline. I'm going to tap off of it, tap back on, so I can see that I've created that outline. Delete my image. And now this is acting as a shape, so I could change it to any color I want, just as if I could do with any shape. And now I can save that shape to my shape library and name it. And since I created it on Keynote, it'll be saved on Keynote on any of my devices. So that's how you create your own shape from an image.